Hi, YouTube. Hey, two friends and family, it's your boy GB Reviews, and today we're doing another hot sauce review. And I wanted to say um, that we've now sprung forward. So, you know, I'm enjoying the warmer weather and hopefully more sunlight. But today we're doing a hot sauce review. Um, it's the uh, it's a new sriracha sauce. It's called Three Mountains. I'm gonna put it up here so you can see. Well, hold up, let's see so you can see it. It looks different than your normal sriracha sauce because it's actually not the red color that people are normally used to. It's like a mustardy color. So I'm excited because I wanna see what this actually tastes like. It says uh, extra spicy sriracha, um, three mountains. And so we're gonna see how hot this is. Today, I got the new Bonchon, cause you know, I love Bonchon and it's in this little small box. And I have, Not everyone has this, so I just like to show it off. These are the Bonchon tacos. Um, if you are not in an area that has Bonchon tacos, I would say request it because Bonchon tacos are awesome. Um, we're gonna open this up, check it out. I'm not exactly sure how hot this is gonna be or how spicy it's gonna be. It's probably not gonna be that spicy, but I'm hoping, I'm hoping that it's gonna be flavorful and it will be a new um, tool in my hot sauce toolkit so we're gonna open it up come seal uh never uh, get a bottle that's not sealed only because you know people can put like nasty things in it or extra hot peppers so look mm. oh that's good and it has a bit of a kick probably more so than your normal sriracha sauce um yeah, I feel it right here in my throat. So let's see how thick it comes out. Got the bottle open. Here's a plate. That's pretty thick, right? And we'll start with chicken, I think. Yeah, we'll start with chicken. Just cause I know what the baseline. So remember, this is baseline. Um, we'll move this down a little bit. This is baseline spicy bonchon chicken. So if you've ever had bonchon chicken and you know how spicy it is, it's not very for people who eat spice, but it is kind of hot. So we're gonna mix that spice with this spice. Hmm. That actually complements the flavor nicely. Um, the banchan chicken, you know, is hot. But the sriracha, it gives a little bit of the um, classic um, sriracha taste, but it has kind of a mustardy taste, if that makes sense. And because of, like I told you, the, the pepper is hitting back here in your the bottom part of my throat it highlights the chicken flavor and so that i have to say is pretty good let's uh let's, let's do that again because we're going to try with different foods just to see what it what it does but this is a drumstick spicy Now, what I will say is that um, it's not, um, this doesn't seem to be yet. A cumulative heat effect. Like the heat just is a consistent heat. But not a cumulative heat. So it's not getting hotter as it goes along. And I might even say that it has diminished slightly. That's, that's pretty good. Um, 
but I think I need more sauce. As you can see, it's like, it's not that hot. We're using a lot of this. This would be good, um, cause I normally eat sriracha in my pho. And, um, and for people who don't know, that's Vietnamese noodles. That, this one would actually be pretty good with pho, I think. Mm. Yeah, the heat seems to be diminishing. If that makes sense. I'm gonna try it with something different. I just wanna see. So, these are spicy sriracha. I mean, uh, spicy banchan tacos with um, spicy banchan sauce, the chicken, and then they put coleslaw on the inside. So we're gonna see. But the chicken itself in the tacos is not so spicy. It's not as spicy as the regular chicken. So we're gonna see if this will spice it up. That's, um, yeah, I'm gonna put more though, but that's pretty good. I'm pretty impressed with the flavor. Um, like I said, it's, um, it was unexpected I found this. I didn't order this, I just found it in my grocery store. So you might be able to find your local grocery store. But um, I found it in the kind of the uh, exotic food aisle. And I was wondering what it would taste like. I was like, uh, would it be good or not? It says yellow sriracha color is made from fresh chilies. ready to apply to any meal. So it doesn't even say that they put mustard in here. I'm looking at the ingredients. It just says chili peppers, no hot mustard, but it actually, I don't know. Let's uh, let you look at that. See if you can see it, but um, yeah, it's not very, it's not very hot, but it is, um, like I said, it's not um, it's not GMO. They said it's all natural by the Three Mountains Company, and it seems to be oh, it's a product of Thailand. So that, oh no, excuse me, it's a product of Vietnam. Contains coconut vinegar. Oh, this is kind of cool. So if you're allergic to coconuts, um, I would say don't. I have never met anyone allergic to coconuts, but if you are allergic to coconuts, you might not want to get it. Um, you know, uh, I'm looking to see if anything else is kind of, says yellow chili, sugar, garlic, vinegar, and salt. So there's no mustard in it at all. They just use yellow chilies, which is kind of cool. Um, no, excuse me, I said a product of Vietnam. This is a product of Thailand, so. Um, if for, for folks who don't know, um, sriracha sauce is actually, it originates from Thailand, even though all the Vietnamese spots have it. And, you know, you'll see the Vietnamese writing on the boxes or on the uh, containers. A lot of people are under the misconception that sriracha is from Vietnam, but actually the master of the heat in Southeast Asia. Are the folks from Thailand? Um, yeah. So the heat diminishes over time. Um, if you're going through a meal, I'm not even putting the heat warning out for this. It's not that hot. Um, on a scale, because they. One of my viewers asked me to start use, consistently using the scale. On my heat scale, 
Uh, this is probably like a four. Or maybe a five. Let me, let me be, let me be more um, generous. It's probably a five. Because I would hate for someone to eat it and be like, oh, this is the hottest thing ever. Not hot thing, no. Anyway, thank you for watching. Please hit the like button for the YouTube algorithm. Um, subscribe and like below. And um, I want to say, you know, I appreciate you guys taking this hot sauce journey with me. If you have hot sauces that you'd like me to try, put it down in the comments. Um, again, I've been trying to consistently stick with hot sauces that are natural pepper hot sauces versus that kind of the chemically made hot sauces. But I don't care. You send me the ones, I'll try it. It's your boy GB Reviews. Again, thank you for watching. Um, enjoy the uh, new daylight savings time that we have. And uh, I'm out. Subscribe, like below. Subscribe and like below. We're out. Subscribe, but like, below.